right back into it. Uh, oh, we got a little kitty cat! Okay. Nice. Alright, hold on one second. So, Alright, uh... So we're right back into it. So welcome back to Tok Tokyo Re Dark Remembrance. And... Okay. Oh, look at kitty cat. Uh, look at laptop. Since that's what first said. What's this? Kazuki must have been looking at uh, before he left. Aw, uh, they like a couple in real and besides detective work though. Mm -hmm. A shrine, red paint. It has all the patterns of the case he's been working on for the last few months. Ikrimuri's been giving him hell. Saying such a minor case is wasting precious police resources. But bull but bullheaded as always, he won't give up give it up. Can't say I get it he, he either, honestly. Chasing after some weird kids and vandals is it his style. It's rude. He's been kind of obsessive about this case, but when I asked him for details, he shrugs me off. Maybe I'll ask him about it when he comes back. Where is he anyway? It's been exhausting being with someone who's on his own schedule all the time. At least, at least he bought me, bought coffee before he left. Otherwise, he'd be in a world of hurt. <laughs> we, yeah, we, yeah. This is my kind of girl. Don't fucking get me started till I have. A, had my coffee, that's all I can say. <laughs> okay. Let's even say it anyway. Um, hold on. So, an elderly, an elderly man was attacked and seriously injured while emerging from a shrine in, Kon in Kanda, Tokyo. Uh, perfection late. Oh, Kon Kanda, Tokyo perfect Prefecture late last night. The man. Ta uh, Takada Aiso, 74, sustained injuries to his head and abdomen, ab 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 including several lacerations. He was admitted to a nearby hospital where he remained safe in stable and critical uh, conditions. According to the police, eyewitness reports eyewitnesses reported hearing a struggle around 11:45. Yeah, 11 45 p.m. and shouting it from a young surrounding voice. When asked if any witnesses had seen or seen the suspect, police said that the, the assailant may have been a high school girl, high school age girl. Ah, so that's where our uh, little redhead comes from. <clears throat> um, local high school, uh, local high schools have been asked by police for any students fitting the witness's description, but so far they have no leads. Citizens in the area are beginning to grow anxious and have called for an increased police presence around the shrines and temples, especially during the time students might be coming and going from school at and late at night. Local police stress that the public should remain calm. Cis Citing that this is an isolated incident in that they are pursuing all leads. Some residents in the area, however, are not impressed by the police response. Local resident Suzuki Kawana, 71, points to a sw swath of random red paint marks on the shrine gate. Oh. <clears throat> and cites a popular theory in the area that they're a is a youth rebellion against traditional Japanese values. Okay, boomer. <laughs> Just slap it right on the screen there. Okay, boomer. Uh, <laughs> please refuse to comment when this was brought up in a recent press conference. Um, for one thing, I don't even, I don't even know um, if that would be a huge rebellion against traditional Japanese values, especially when there's like still, um, practically a lot of traditions in Japan, from what, from what I've heard, still like, you know, 
kept in tradition pretty much kept celebrated and whatnot and kept in honor and whatnot um, so <laughs> correct me if I'm wrong sorry um, authorities uh, spe speculate that these this attack may be potentially linked to a series of crimes surrounding shrines and attempt in the area but this is the first time any violent action has occurred the first incident occurred two months ago and resulted in the main hall of a local local shrine suffering fire damage, but no injuries. Uh, another incident reported several weeks later when a local resident noticed several dead cats in front of a shrine's gate. Ooh, okay. Uh, police were are hesitant to link the crimes because of the lack of space specific pattern. True? I mean, I'm pretty sure it's definitely, like, connectable. Got red paint, aka pot, pretty much blood, I can tell you that. Like, all over shrines. <laughs> this stuff is shrine related. And you pretty much got dead cats in front of shrines. What? Oh, it's not. It is not um connected in any way possible. <laughs> I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay. Um, let's exit. Speaking of kitty cat. Oh, we can make kitty cats. Good morning, good morning, the F Lady Fluffington. <laughs> what? <laughs> that is so gen pretty much generic. so happy. Aw, oh, look at that kitty. Yeah, look at that kitty. That's a stairs deep into your soul playing playing on world domination. I guess Kazuki already left, huh? Hey, Paul. Yeah. <laughs> you, didn't, you didn't drive him out, did you? Lady Fluffington, you would not have um, pushed out the man of this pr nice princess's dreams, would you have? Nobody scratchy. <laughs> uh, she she may have a tough. I will say every girl has their soft tough sides. And then there's girls, but they always have a soft spot, no matter what. That's all I can say. Be safe. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. Well, that settles. Well, that settles that, I guess. <coughs> you see, this thought right here is basically a cat whisper. So. <laughs> okay. You've been you've been good with him lately, haven't you? If only you can marry you shared your enthusiasm. <laughs> the, the the grumpy boomer detective needs to learn a few things from a cat. <laughs> uh, something tells me he'll get over it though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> do we ha do we have to play right now? <laughs> uh, yes, I'm pretty sure it's a fucking yes. All right, all right. Where'd you hide your, your toy in this time? Oh, so we gotta look up for the. F Hi. Um, go to the bedroom. Oh, okay, it's the bedroom. Um, can we look at anything with the laptop? No, we can't. Okay. We'll go to the bedroom then. There's a toy. Oh. Oh, okay. 
<gasps> oh, it's so ting- It's a freaking lucky cat, pretty much, ain't it? Or something like that? I think in, um, uh, what the fuck game is that? Um, shit. Lucky cat, just the palm kind of moves like back and forth pretty much. Oh, it's so cute. Um, Minicky, Minicky Neko is Lady Fluffington's favorite toy and has stuffed or suffered from months of her battling it around. <laughs> the, the Neko has seen some very, very uh, intense battles. I remember this fight in Vietnam, back in Nam. The napalm falling, they're in the trees. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, if I see any while, while I'm out, I should pick pick up a, yeah, I should pick a new one up. Who knows, they might even bring us good luck. I, right, girl, Ito, this cat, the lucky cat is lucky enough. Um, is there anything else? No, okay. Living room. Um, yeah, baby's been Nicky 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 for, for the life of me. I can't figure out why you love this thing so much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, whatever. It is in. I'm glad it makes you ha so happy, little boy. Oh. <gasps> Stop. Excuse me, there seems to be someone at my freaking door. <laughs> um, let me look at the laptop real quick. Nothing cool. Okay, okay. Um, <laughs> answer the freaking door. Oh, you me. Okay. Hello, neighbor. Konnichiwa. <laughs> Konnichiwa. Oh, hey, Yumi. Do you, uh, want to come in? No, nope. I'm, I'm on my way out, but I wanted to drop this off first. Um, it certainly has a distinct odor. Oh, no. Angie <laughs> Family Recipe. Creamy Curry Donut. Creamy Curry do Curry Donuts. I'm pretty sure Brock from Pokemon said uh, just looking out in the corner, just heavy breathing, like, nothing beats a jelly filled donut. Coconut honey, curry powder, but the secret is the five hot chill chilies that are hidden in the, in the batter. Oh, ch chilies? Ooh, uh, I don't know about that. They have quite the kick. These these bad these bad boys will clean your soul with fire inside and out. Yeah. Wait, how are the chilies hidden in the batter? You mean I'm not so sure. <laughs> no need to no need to thank me. Your body will thank me after you eat them. I do not trust eating them, so no. But anyways, how have you been? All I see, like, see lately, are convenience stores, box, convenience, convenience stores, box lunches, and junk food. Yeah, I got a couple of commas in there, doves. Uh, or never mind. It's supposed to be convenience store, convenience store, box lunches, and junk food. I'm sorry, my brain just went way out somewhere else. Okay. Um, you need to take care of yourself. I'd be happy to cook for you two if you want. You're welcome anytime. Mm. Wait, how old is he? How old is this girl anyway? What? How about tonight? I mean, after you're done with 
done working out sometime? Tonight might might be a bit tricky, and our shifts so I can run a little late. Unless you're happy with us dropping dropping in around 2 a.m. Hmm, you make a good point there, neighbor. It's bad enough with the, you clomping around at night. At, I am right beneath you, you know. Uh oh. <clears throat> Listen, what uh, what what you hear of the shaking of the bed up there upstairs at night? Do not fucking worry about it. It's our freaking time, okay? So shh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what the freak am I even going with it? Um, sorry, Yumi. Uh, you can't blame the clomping on Kazuki. Oh, you can. You can blame the clomping on Kazuki. I'm white as a feather. Yeah, fucking fat ass. Fucking fat ass Kazuki. <laughs> there's, there's stuff in my brain that is kicking in. That I'm probably knowing what some of it probably is. Thoughts out of my head. Moving on. Don't be sorry. It's the price of living below someone. It's so interesting. Then again, there was uh, that one time you started singing at 4 a.m. Uh, uh, Oi! Do not. Do not shun a girl for singing at 4 a.m. I will legit come out and be like. What the fuck you doing? It's 4 a.m. Why are you singing? You sing her all happy and then my mood would turn on and be like, I'm tired, but you know what? If it makes her happy, yes, I will do it. <laughs> I, will, I will go in the kitchen, sing with her, even, even make freaking um, chili curry donuts. Fuck it. <laughs> you was sharing something about the night not being able to end until you sang some idol song. What was it again? <laughs> That's okay, you can forget about that. <laughs> I'm sorry, it was it was the um the theme theme of my favorite anime. I just couldn't stop singing it, okay? Shut up. Uh to be to be honest, I liked it. It was reassuring to hear you sing what's up. Who the fuck is texting me? Also but Uno Momento Oh what am I gonna do with him? Okay. Yeah, it's not like they're shooting sorry to hear you hear you loosen up. Plus I like to think it it gives gives me a window into a detective's into detective's <laughs> into detective Ito's real side, you know. What I mean? My real side? Huh. Well, I do like karaoke. Uh, were you, were you part of the group that always went to karaoke? Uh, I, I'm a shy person, in per, shy person, in, in person, I should say, and let me just say that I would not be one of the ones to um, go and do karaoke with friends. I'm, I'd be too nervous to do something like that. Huh? Then we, should, then we should go sometime. I can sing in English too. I'm a pro. My girl, my girlfriend's uh, thought. My girlfriend's thought I was half. I was half. I'm quite talented, you see. Damn, that's my work phone. Oh, okay. I can get going anyway. Bye, Yami. Hmm? hmm? Don't forget my offer, okay? Go over sometime. Hey, well, sorry, Yumi. I got to take this. Hi. Hi. Ito here. Kazuki, is that you? Yeah, it's me. Thanks for picking up. I didn't know who else I could who else to call. I was wondering where you, where you wander off to. Why are you calling me on this phone? You're not on the clock, are you? Sorry, I couldn't. couldn't sorry, I couldn't leave this one alone. Oh, sorry, I couldn't leave this one alone. I think I've made a big break. What? The 
Mystery of the Broken Coffee Maker? Oof. She knows. Uh, uh, listen, I can, I can explain. I was a cat. I was playing with a cat. I ended up... <laughs> Uh, tried to chase her toy, and I accidentally ran it, had her hit the, uh, coffee maker, but I got, you know what, we're, we're just gonna drop that for now. <laughs> nope, unfortunately, the case will likely remain unsolved. You know, you know, it's a damn cat. The shrine, the shrine case I've been working on, I think I found, I think I found a pattern. All of those shrines that are connected to people whose names are said, Kawana, Kawana. There's so many ways to, to write Kawana in Chinese characters that were that we didn't see the connection before. It's like our suspect has been going up and down Tokyo, going to shrines one by one, looking for someone. That would that would explain the the pattern scene. Her pattern seems so random. Does it explain the weird markings or ra or the random violence, though? No, but but it's, no, but yeah, no, but it's a start. I had a bit of a snoop, though. The rec no, I had the bit had a bit of a snoop through the records, and I think she'll be in the Kama Kamakuri next. I'm heading there now. I can be there a little over an hour. What do, you, what do you need me to do? Thanks, Ayumi. I knew I could count on you. Don't trust anyone else. I'm just about to arrive, so I'll get started on the on the like work here, interviewing people in the area and seeing you, seeing what they know. Meanwhile, once you're there, or once you get here, I'll need an official stop. I'll need the official stuff, surveillance footage, public records, and the like. And the like. Uh, what the fuck is going on in my head right now? Let's get it here. I'll need official stuff, sur official stuff, surveillance footage, public records, and the like. Okay, not much to go on, but together we should find something. So I get the boring stuff. Serves me right for showing up late, huh? Oh, did you sleep in? Ugh, I know what that feels. Ugh, let's not talk about that, shall we? <laughs> I'll get, I'll get you a drink after. Promise, Ayami. Oh, promise, Ayami. Keep an eye out for red paint too. It's been at all the other crime scenes. I'll see you soon. Be careful. I'm right. If I'm right, this person might be dangerous. Oh no, short. Red paint everywhere. Okay, what? Okay. In retrospect, the way Kazuki sounded on the phone that day was off. Under his normal enthusiasm, it was his hesitation. A little shaky in his voice. That should have told me something was wrong. At the, at the time, I chalked it up to overwork. After all, he hadn't been sleeping much in the weeks prior. Oh, is he turning your back on you, girl? Oh, shit. Mm. If only I'd known and had it put put up a wall of normal normality to hide it from it. Instead of explaining away his obsession with the case and ignoring him as he tossed and turned, I should have talked to him. In all fairness, I wasn't the only one trying to ignore reality. Katsuki was a fierce investigator. Once he grabbed a hold of something, he followed it no matter what, no matter how dangerous it was. He kept me in the dark as long as I, he could, but in the end, he needed me. So he, when he called me, he tried his best to, to laugh and joke and to throw me off the scent. It worked. It worked because I let it. Uh oh, is shit going wrong?
play a little bit longer then I'm got to uh, kind of uh, tone it down because I got because my parents bedroom is right next door and I do not have freaking uh, sound foam in this room which I probably should get at some point shouldn't I huh. anyway oh whoops about the security station. <laughs> Welcome to Kam Kamakura. I, I, was I was actually looking for some information. Information? Well, you come to the right or come to the right guy. Name's, name's Magur Magura. Did you know that I'm no more... Uh, did you know that I'm no more station attendant? No mere attendant. I read that wrong. No mere sta station attendant, but also a volunteer tour guide on my days off. A jack of all trades. I can see from your from your blank ex blank expression that what is up with that face? <laughs> I can see uh, from your blank expression that you don't believe me, but I'm the best there ever was. I'm not even from around here, and I could tell you, still tell you everything there is to know about this place. That's great. Guidebooks, maps, the internet? <sighs> oh no, he's a boomer, isn't he? <laughs> all, all silly toys and for amateurs. I've got, I've got all up here. Right, that's um great. Magura. Is, is that Japanese? Um, um, anyway, what kind of security do you have at the station? Are there many cameras set up here in, or around town? Eh? Ca cameras, you say? I guess I should explain. I'm a detective with the Tokyo Metropolitan... Met Metropolitan... I still can't pronounce it. Metropolitan... Please. Ah, I ah see. I oh ah see. Hi, kid guy. Ah see, I'm really less of a current event kind of guy, and more of a people and dates sort. Some call me a master of time and identity. If I had the heart. I harnessed my incredible knowledge and ability to examine minutes of events, I could have become a great detective myself. Yeah, I'm sure that's true. Well, okay, maybe this one's a bit more up your alley. Can you tell me more about the shrines around here? Maybe some off the beaten path? Oh, I know. Just down the street, there's an old shrine and... And... Yes? The shrine is, um, old. The shrine is, um, old and, uh, nice? Go on. Okay, okay, okay. So dates aren't really my thing. But that w wasn't fair. But that wasn't fair. You caught me unawares with that one. I really am quite knowledgeable. Yep, I, b I believe you. So where is the shrine? That way! <laughs> Just up the road to the right. Or was it down the left? <sighs> We're never gonna get anything anywhere with this guy. Sorry, directions aren't really my thing. <sighs> yeah, I'm thinking it's I think it's time to, to just beat myself out the window. Oh, I see. Well, what do you know then? 
Um, well, the locals say it has a weird aura to it, see? But you didn't know that. <laughs> Nani? <laughs> the glass trick. Yeah, I'll uh, have a look around for myself. Yeah, let's please get away from this weird freaking guy. Okay, my controller just freaking vibrated as well. Oh, hello! Red markings. Red paint. I guess Kazuki's hunch was right. But why is this house? I'll leave it for now. For Furness might be able to make something out of it. Forensic. Forensic? Forensic? I thought you were bad at weeding. Trying to look at the environment, make sure I see anything. <sighs> that fucking girl just fucking scared me. Uh, the divide between the sacred and us mortals. The shrine it belongs to, uh, belongs to must be up ahead. That's either gonna bring off a lot of attention or that's gonna like Let me see if I can find something else. Oh wait, hello. Look. I love the cherry blossoms this time of year. Kasuki and I will have to arrange a picnic before they're gone. Can I take it? This looks uh, just long enough for the fish out of the objects in the water. Aha! Uh, I'm sorry about taking your stuff, by the way. Oh, there wasn't anything else I could take. Um, I'm pretty sure once you find the thing, one of the things you're supposed to do to uh, collect something, it's completely gone. Backtracker, huh? <clears throat> the travel pass. To something Tuku to Kamakura. Kamakura. The train pass. It, the train pass. And just like I thought, it has red paint on it. I should go to the station and see who this belongs to. Oh, do we really have to go to see, see Mr. Uh, creepy Person again? And at least he's not as creepy as the fat guy from the freaking butterfly camp, butterfly bar. Hi. What can what can the great Magura Magura help you with? I found this commu community pass by the stream. Can you tell me who it belongs to? Yeah, sure. Just is is that b blood? Oh, the red markings? No, it's paint. I think it's totally blood. You think? Blood isn't really my thing. 
It's de it's definitely not blood. Smell it. Smell? No, no need. I believe you. Right, it's not blood. Give it here. <laughs> wow. Okay, a little bit, a little bit got on me, but it's fine. No, no problem. No problem. <laughs> it's just pain. Not blood. Nope. Not blood. Deep breaths, Magura. <sighs> in out. In. In out. Nama, stay. Okay. Right. Sorry about the temporary loss of composure. Allow me to effortlessly find the owner of this pass. Damn thing. I'll just swipe it, swipe it again. Here. Aha! Let's see. Mm hmm. As fortunate would have it, I, would, I know the owner of this card. It belongs to it belongs to Mai, the youngest daughter of the Kawana, Kawana family. A very interesting family indeed. Um, would that be our uh, crazy bitch? Oh, and what makes makes them so interesting? Well, they own a lot of land in the area and have donated a considerable amount of local shrine amount to the local shrine, as well as I of as well. Uh, a lot to a considerable amount to the local shrine as well. I often see my my working there. The house next to the station where the laundry hung up outside actually belongs to their grandmother. Except for my, they're all a pretty cloist cloistered lot. Okay. She's she's usually a very cheerful, careful girl. I can't see her dropping her pass without coming to see me about it. I know all about those passes. I've thought. After all, I'm I'm the expert on the train passes. Right. Seems that you couldn't tell me a direction to where uh, things were, to where the shrine was. Why's a good kid? You know you don't think she's gotten involved with nefarious types, do you? Not at all. Not that I'm aware of. I'm sure there's so nothing, but. I wouldn't mind talking to her regardless. Well, if she's here, she's probably at her grandmother's. Anything else you'd like to know? That's all for now. Thanks. So, she's at the house we just took the cherry blossoms from. A dark room covered in dust. Hard to believe someone actually lives here. There doesn't seem to be anyone home. What was that? It sounded like it came from behind me. Get that gun out. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna just walk the other direction. <laughs> Fine. Enter, I guess. <laughs> 